Hey Akanksha, how's it going? Oh hi, it's going good. How about you? All good. By the way, I want to ask you some questions for Vibe Magazine's March issue. Are you ready? Oh yes, let's do it. Okay. For the first question, what's keeping you busy these days? Work, a lot of it and a lot of phone calls. What makes you bored in life the most right now? I think again working from home. That's getting very boring if you ask me. True. What is the most exciting thing in your life right now? Um well, I have a beach holiday planned next month, so that's something I'm really excited about and looking forward to. Wow, sounds like a plan. Where was your last holiday to? So this was back in 2019. I had gone to Sri Lanka for my birthday. It's a small country, but it has so much to offer. There are beaches, there are lakes, there are jungle safaris, there's even scuba diving. It's an amazing place. Okay. What's your favorite cocktail? Well, I would say an LIT, but I'm okay with a good old Jack and Coke. Speaking of that, it's got me very thirsty. Oh, sorry about that. Don't worry, I've got my drink right here. Okay, cool. Can you share with us your favorite Netflix series at the moment? Well, um, the latest one I watched was Crime Scene, and I loved it. That's my go-to genre. Awesome. What food do you usually eat when watching Netflix? Well, more than eating, I think I drink a lot of coffee. What's one thing you can't leave your house without? Well, these days it would be my face mask and sanitizer, but I'd also say my phone. My nice answer. What's your spirit animal? That would be a cat. Don't ask me why. I won't. What did you want to do in life at age five? Well, um, I wanted to be a fashion designer. Then I wanted to be a writer. After that, uh, I wanted to be a criminal psychologist, and now here I am, an HR professional. Oh yeah, there was also a pop singer phase in between. Okay, here's a tough question for you. What's your favorite curse word? Fuck. Oh damn. What's the first thing you do in the morning? Don't tell me opening your eyes. <laughs> well, I can't start my day without my coffee. Nice. I see. What's your go-to fashion piece? I would say a good pair of jeans. Okay. Here's a timely one. What's your take on the pandemic? Oh well, it's been a life-changing experience for everybody. I think from the way we live our lives, from the way we work, every small thing in our day-to-day -day life, everything's changed. Can you share an example of how the pandemic affected your work? Well, um So I'm a kind of person who hates phone calls. I prefer in-person interactions more. And now because of the pandemic, almost all of my work is on phone calls, Zoom calls, team calls. So that's been a great change for me. Speaking of work, how did intelligentsia change your life? I think it's made me a workaholic. I just hope in a good way. If the pandemic is personified, what will you tell him or her? I'm going to tell him let's break up and it's not me it's you. <laughs> Do you have a makeup routine? Well, uh, I usually just use kajal, liner and lip balm. Interesting. How about you describe yourself in one word? Well, the first and only word that comes to mind is travel holic if that's even a word. But traveling is something that I really like to and need to do. Just going to a new place, letting that vibe of that place sink in, it just recharges me. Okay. What is your greatest struggle during your tenure in intelligence? I think this past year has been quite challenging with everybody working remotely from different parts of the country. Managing work like that, I think that's been very challenging. Okay. Finally, last question. What message do you want to give to all the women out there watching this? Well, I just want to say that you have just this one life. So do whatever your heart pleases because this is the only life you're going to get. So don't care what anybody says or what anybody thinks, just do what you like. You go girl. All right, that's a wrap. Thank you, Kangsha. I hope you had fun answering the questions. I did. This was a really fun experience. Thank you. Bye-bye.